thing that they possess tonight is they knew how to p play at a certain pace. And um, that pace was just too fast for us. And then once you figure out, like, oh, okay, this is how we need to do things, by that point you're already down. And against a team like that, you can play a certain way if you're with them, but you can't play a certain way when you're down. And so that was really the biggest thing. They did a good job getting out to us early. Um, Faceoff guys struggled with Chris. He did a great job. Um, you know, it wasn't so much how things were going X and O's wise that they were playing at a certain tempo and we weren't able to match that. that, 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 that that's, that's some little things with just being tighter on your man, having your head on a swivel and things like that. So I mean, that's just things you have to kind of clean up. So. What things do you want to work on for the, the next game for the rest of the season? Um, well, I mean, that's a good question, but the, the main thing that you need to work on is a game like this, and I say this with absolute sincerity, um, it was nice that the it was a 60-minute game. Um, they were obviously playing well tonight, and we weren't, and he very easily could have gone down the bench, and we wouldn't have learned dick about ourselves. I apologize. I'm sorry. We wouldn't have learned anything about ourselves. Um, so it was nice tonight because you got to see how are we going to respond for an entire 60 minutes. So I, I was very happy because we can go back and look on tape now and we can analyze, okay, what worked, what didn't. And also just from an individual player standpoint, some people we've had because of injuries and some other things, we've had to move certain people around and some of those people aren't going to be able to stay at those positions. So it's I, I, I didn't want us playing our best tonight. Clearly we didn't. <laughs> But uh, I need us playing our best when division play comes. So very good. All right, what uh, is there a game or a team that you're looking forward to playing the this season? I, I don't mean to give you the standard answer, but uh, the, I, I I mean this sounds way too cliche, like a coach. But the, the, they're all you look forward to all of them. Sure, absolutely. Um, the ones that we obviously have circled on our calendar are the division guys, because that's what's going to come down. That's to what it comes players. down to. Absolutely. So, um, Arizona State, U of A, San Diego State, USD. And, but I've scheduled this hard purposely in the beginning of the season because we need to see, again, that pace of play, that how fast the game is at this level. And uh, if we're able to do that this year, next year we bring everybody back. And so it'll be – it's an ongoing process. So Good deal. Uh, who are some key players that uh, we should keep an eye on this season? For us or for them? For you guys. Um, for us, it would be, um, well, after a game like that, I don't really know who the hell you'd want to keep an eye on. Uh, but um, the one thing I did, uh, was very happy with tonight, and it is a small, very small consolation, is our goalie uh, was in the Marines for eight years. He hasn't played for an incredibly long time. And he got shell-shocked tonight. Sure. And kids we've had in the past, not just on this team, but other teams I've played on, you face a barrage like that, and we would have had to pull him, we would have had to, you know, call timeout just to talk to him, whatever, and he was still making saves in the fourth quarter. Now, there's some I'm sure he'd like to have back, and there was some where he was out of position or something like that, right, but right. those are things we can fix. You can't fix what's inside someone, and he showed that he'll just get better, so that, that was the one... Um, as I said, small consolation from tonight. So. Who's your goalie? What's his number and name? Uh, Chris Castleberry. Very good. Excellent. All right, Coach uh, Mike Dewan, again, once again, thank you for your time. University of San Diego men's head coach for lacrosse.